Greetings YouTube, Danny Staten here for the Daily Dan Blog, main channel. You're looking at a Smokey the Bear comic book, something I've never seen before. It's from 1969. It's put out by the forestry department. Dude, it sent to me, paid five dollars. I got this Smokey the Bear through the mail from WWE Contest Entry, The Blondie, who is in my top five thanks to his generous donations. He sent me two comic books this week. I'll be reviewing the other one later. The number one he sent me was the Smokey the Bear True Story. I don't know if it's the number one or not because I've never seen nothing like this in my whole life. Well done, Mr. Blondie. Well done. Looks like the Forest Service has been putting out these books since 1960. This was the 1969. It'd be the third print. But it's not. It's, it would be not only a number one and number zero, the only one they made, apparently. It's the origin story of Smokey the Bear. It starts out at a beautiful day in the park where the birds are flying and the fish are swimming and they're swimming around. Smokey was a bear cub then, playing in the water, trying to catch him a damn fish. The eagle warns him, Smokey, something bad's happening. A dumbass has thrown out a match. Oh, my God. The forest catches fire. It catches fire. Oh, my God. It catches fire. Luckily, Ranger Spock here spots the fire and calls out the army. Because the army who fights fires, right? These these don't look like forest guys. These look like army guys. Oh, I get. I guess back in the day, forest service people were wore uniforms like the army. Maybe. Anyway, the fire blazes. All the animals run for their life. Smokey's mom and dad burn to death. Oh, my God! Smokey's mom and dad burn to. Oh, dear. YouTube, as you know, I was burned as a small child. These fire scenes really fuck with me bad. As the fire rages on, people are burned. Forests are burned. Smokey's mom and dad are burned. The freaking deers are burned. My God, what a graphic comic book. I really like the art in this comic book, even though everybody's getting burned up and dying. Oh, this poor guy. Oh, my God. Well, YouTube, as the bodies of the firemen are laid to rest, patched, the wounded. Oh, oh, God, what a horrible story. Somebody finds a cute little bear clinging to a tree. His mom and dad barbecued by the fire. Apparently, a great deal of the forest was burned out, and a lot of everybody and everything in it died. Smokey's ass even had some little burns on his little teeny tiny furry bear paws. Oh, my God, what a horrible book. This is just awful for children. But it gets cute now because Smokey gets patched up. Smokey gets healed. Smokey gets to be the pet of all the forest rangers and this pleasy looking homosexual child. Oh, oh my God. And they even award him a little hat for surviving the fire. Look, they're Boy Scouts back there now. Don't they look like Hitler Youth for some reason back then? Huh, I just noticed that. And they even made his first little poster. I'm not sure what it says, but they made him a little poster. So apparently the bear learned to talk from living with the forest rangers. Does that happen? Can bears really talk? And now he gets on TV and says, Only you can prevent forest fires. Only you. And I really like the part where he tells the story about how all the people and his mother and dad and all the animals burned to death in the massive fire. That's... Just freaking touching. And at least the book ends on a happy note with a wonderful message from Smokey the Bear telling you how you can prevent forest fires by throwing water on your fire. Make sure it's out. And it even has a nice little letter in the back for the reader. I'll let you read it. Do -do 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 -do. You might have to pause this motherfucker to read it, but I'm, I'm going to let you read it. I'm not going to... Oh, look! I have a Smokey the Bear autograph for my collection! I'm so overjoyed! I can Smokey that fucking bear. Really. Oh, my God!
Remember kids, be careful with every fire. Always make sure it's out. And remember, only you can prevent forest fires. So that's my look at Smokey the Bear's origin story, which I have to say was fucking terrifying. It had fire, it had people dying, it had animals being burnt to death. I really wouldn't give this to no child that was under 13. If this come out today, it'd probably have a rated R stuck to it. I hope you enjoyed my look at Smokey the Bear put out by the Forestry Service and promised to scare the hell out of every child who read it back in the day. I'm glad I never saw it when I was a child. I'm not real sure about how much I like it now. This is Daddy Staten from the Daily Dan Blog, main channel, saying, Fuck Smokey the Bear. Fuck you. And that was a horrible comic book.